So, um, Mercado Apartments was the first, um, first apartment complex that Mac Project uh, built, and it was 14 years ago. And so next year is our 15th anniversary. So at that time, you know, Barrio Logan has always had, you know, kind of like a rough feel to it, you know. There's always been a lot of gangs at that time, a lot of drugs, violence. And so um, it, was, it, was, it was pretty dangerous at that time. So for Mercado to be, to be established here, a low-income housing complex in this neighborhood, you know, there was a lot of questions of whether it was actually you know, going to be a positive thing in the neighborhood or a negative, you know? And so um, over the years, this complex, I think, has represented, you know, um, a very positive aspect in the community because it's just very well um, well presented. It's a, it's a beautiful community itself, like its structure, its uh, actual color schemes, and it's just, it keeps, it's very clean as much as possible. And the residents, you know, are, are are very good human beings, you know? I mean, there's always, you know, just in general, um, people, they, you know, have problems or issues or whatever, but like, just like in any community. But overall, I think um, people have been really, really proud of this community because it was the first one. And um, there was there was always kind of speculations of whether or not, um, you know, this apartment complex could survive, you know, just being how beautiful it is structurally and you know in, in terms of community as well so for it to to have made it throughout these the years and um, it's been a really good reflection of how how beautiful and how clean and how united and how much support we have in this community you know so and this is like I said this is through through um, my own personal experience of this neighborhood uh, before at that time and also through the community itself the residents um, are great you know it's just they they're bringing people from different parts of San Diego from different parts of Mexico and just establishing a community that's so united um, has really brought out a lot to the community and it's also they do a lot of work in the community as well volunteer um, they attend the Cesar Chavez school they attend all the schools around here so I think Mercado and also the, the people that uh, provide services here. I mean, the community around, they'd be like, okay, go to Mercado or go to the ERC, which is right here in the corner. So I go there to find about the food bank because every month we do um, distribute food bank to the San Diego food bank. Like if you want food, go to Mercado. If you want, you know, sign up for Choice for Tots at Mercado or at the ERC. So it's like not only they know we're an apartment complex, but we're a place where we have uh, resources and everything's for free. And if you have any type of problem with, you know, or any issue, whether it's with the police or with, you know, with um, uh, immigration or you just need a place to stay, you know, they know this is a good place to have, at least to get informed, you know, on the resources that are out there. Basically, if you need help with anything, I tell you, call me. If I can't help you, I'm going to get somebody to help you. Llegué a este país uh, cuando me separé de mi esposo. Yeah. Eh, me traje a mi niño para buscar una nueva vida y um, batallé mucho, pero gracias a Dios uh, creo que salí adelante. Uh, la primera vez que llegué aquí uh, pasé dos, tres veces el el borde y, um, y llegué aquí trabajando en México era secretaria ejecutiva y aquí llegué a limpiar baños a limpiar oficinas y pues eh, fue un cambio muy drástico porque yo estaba acostumbrada a otro tipo de, de, de cosas y de amistades y, pero creo que es la mejor decisión que yo he tomado porque a mi hijo aquí a, estudió hasta cuarto, cuarto año. Tuve una niña de una niña y a, después tuve problemas. Me regresaron a México por dos años y a los dos años volví a regresar y me casé con la misma persona que era que es el padre de mi hija. Eh, 
antes vivía en la 26, 10 Street y uh, viví muy a gusto ahí en el Golden Hill y, y uh, tuve, apliqué aquí por tres años y luego entré aquí y uh, cambió mi vida porque aquí creo que he, he prosperado un poco aunque también tuve problemas me, me, aquí se me declaró de que tenía cáncer en el, en el seno y mi esposo me dejó eh, pero bueno adentro de lo que cabe yo he salido adelante eh, eh, con amigas y eh, apoyo familiar y todo y mi hijo ahorita este, está en la, es ciudadano ya eres a Dios y está en la Navy ah, mi hija también es, está bien, entonces yo pienso que el cambio aquí en Mercado Apartment para mí ha sido muy, pues muy beneficioso tanto para mí como para mis hijos y uh, trato de salir adelante día a día. Uh, yo sé que el cáncer ahí lo tengo, pero voy a salir adelante. Eh, aquí este es un lugar que realmente a mí sí me gusta porque más que nada pienso que dentro del de Mercado Carmen estamos pues bien, pero ya afuera sí puedo decir que hay como en todas partes peligro, pero, pero pues eso, eso es una bonita experiencia vivir aquí y más que nada porque estoy trabajando, tengo 10 años en el mismo lugar y, y pienso que, es, que estamos bien aunque esté yo separada, pero creo que estoy bien, estoy bien con mi hija y vivo nada más con mi hija aquí ahorita, porque mi hijo está en Aran.